to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. game this between two very high quality sides a treat for everybody here well under normal circumstances this is a massive matchup and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away in my experience if the opposition go at it full tilt then you have to reciprocate we'd like to see excitement and be entertained but if it does go down the serious route there'll still be lots to enjoy So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? I would think Sun Young min the South Korean. He can play anywhere in attack, but ideally his, his most success seems to come from wide and his incisive inward bursts. He may not yet be regarded as a great goal scorer, but he has real ambition to get there. Yeah, hard to see past him. He'll be looking to put on a show, I'm certain of that. It's being played forward. Werner, Hoiberg cuts it out, battles to win it back, Abraham, and here's Kane, now it's Bale, Bale, oh well played, he needed to get that right, it's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. And it's Chilwell. He's through the middle. And he heaves it forward. Aimed in towards the centre. Cut out in the nick of time. Now yeah, that does look a foul, referee's given a free kick. Tottenham have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. And here's Bale. Going through, plays it up to meet it! it! Just took too long getting forward. Kane simply took an age to make his mind up, Peter, when urgency was the, the single requirement.
Conte. Chelsea still without an attempt on target. And it's Chilwell. And they've been caught out here. Great leap! Just couldn't turn it in. No, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. Whistle's gone, presumably for offside. <laughs> Tries to get it forward quickly. Zayak. Dyer. And if anyone is going to break the deadlock, now would be a good time. Ricky Lon. Hoiberg. Gets it back. With Sayak. Now the counter. He's pinged one through here. Massive goal! And always such a great time to score. A brilliant boost before you head in for half time, and you can guarantee that dressing room will be buzzing now. Chelsea are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter attacking heaven. A 1-0 lead established. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Conte. Forward it goes. Werner. <laughs> Tottenham have a free kick. And no surprise, that's a booking. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. <laughs> the first half compared with your expectation. Peter, this is far from a lost cause. Yes, they've been hit once by a, a pacey opposition, but they've asserted more control and, and look capable. Chelsea, the happier of the teams, heading in for half-time, 1-0 up. Dropping into the second 45 minutes. A solitary goal. Hits one! <laughs> Two up and threatening to pull clear. The keeper deserves some sympathy there. He may not have seen that until too late.
Chelsea grab a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. It's a loose ball. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Werner. With Sayak. Good ball. Aldevera gets rid without sophistication. Chelsea have it back and they can go again. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Yeah, and having played his part in the goal, a tightening up was inevitable. The ball's loose, and he's after it. <laughs> Hoists it forward. Well played, he saw that coming. Conte. Tottenham uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. And it's Son Hyung Min. Abraham brings it forward. Zayak and Zayak! And it's there! And the lead is extended still further. Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. It's really a problem when that much time is afforded the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. Tottenham have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Back to the keeper and go again. Loris gets it upfield. Has he picked him out? No complaints about that challenge. Had a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. <laughs> Loris sends that a long way. And they win it back again. It's Zayek. Well, that's pretty clear. It is a foul. He knew what was coming. That's a yellow card. Players protesting furiously, but there's little or no sympathy from the ref. Chelsea presented with the perfect chance here to open up their lead. He's shaping up to have a crack from here. And he's going to Rex. He has got his work done. Werner. Zayak. Kovacic. Shoots! And he should have made it for... Chelsea were again presented with an opportunity to break and look very, very threatening. <laughs> There's going to be another change here. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag. And a header! This is 
this utopian. Just so calm under pressure. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a meal the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of, oh, you've got him, oh, you don't, will you? It's become a case of men against boys. Aurier. Alderweireld. Across the field it goes. Reggie Lon tries to stroke it through. And it's played forward. Abraham. Kovacic. He's had a goal! Contest no more, it is nothing short of utter humiliation. Well, I think we've gone past humiliation now. This could be doing some real psychological damage. Chelsea totally rampant here. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Kovacic sticks in a foot to win it back. Lucas Moura. Aurier. And time is up. And a great day for attacking football. The artists have painted their...